I think I finally hit that point where you realize that Invisalign does have drawbacks. I haven't done an update in a while. I'm sorry about that. Uh, the reason why is that there hasn't really been that much of a change. I have been wearing these aligners for the past seven weeks. That's why they're so yellow and gross. I will show you close-ups as always, but you will be able to tell that my teeth are not that different from last time. This canine here is not tracking. So the visit before last, I was warned that it didn't look like it was tracking. So I was told they might have to do a new scan and then order new aligners and my orthodontist told me that he could, like, we could do it at the end in, like, the refinement process, but there really wasn't any reason to wait. So he didn't really give me that option. He just was like, no, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna try to fix this right away. At the last visit I had at my orthodontist, uh, we did a new scan, we took new x-rays, uh, they took pictures and um, essentially I had to wear the same liner for another, I counted, it's been like seven weeks. I will, I'll put them on and I'll show you. My speech is just not the best. It's been like eight and a half, almost nine months now and I am still... <laughs> so, um, you know. I no longer believe that it will get better because obviously my speech would have been more normal if it was ever going to be, but uh, I will show you. So you can see this gap here. So as you can see, there is a gap between the aligner and this canine, especially when you compare it to these other teeth where everything is sort of like closed. There isn't that like gap between the teeth and the aligner. So that is obviously the way it's supposed to be. Hopefully the road ahead will be better. I don't really know why this one doesn't want to move. The one positive thing about it is that I have been able to eat more hard foods. So like I have been enjoying that, but I kind of miss the pain now. I kind of want it to keep moving forward. And obviously when I did get Invisalign or when I went to the consultation, I was warned that this is one of the drawbacks of Invisalign compared to braces because with braces, you can just adjust them in the chair as you're there. But with Invisalign, you have to do new scans and order and it takes a long time because obviously these have to ship to Norway from the US and that takes even longer. And it's been like summer holidays. So things have just been taken so long. It was really the wrong timing for that tooth to just act out. So I did know, but there's this tendency to think that any potential issues are not going to be your issues. Um, so I guess maybe I did that a little bit. Uh, and I've been using Chewies and everything and I don't really know, obviously I'm not trained. <laughs> so I don't know why this one in particular didn't really move. And I guess it's been harder for this tooth to sort of move in line as well when the other one hasn't moved the way it's supposed to. Like I probably did another month changing out my aligners weekly before everything just stopped. So there wasn't that much um, to see, but hopefully things will be back on track now. But I will show you. So you can see this gap right here is essentially what is meant to close now on both sides. So I've been wearing these. They're so stained and they're really gross and I'm really sick of it. But I do have an appointment at the orthodontist today in a few hours. So I'm really excited to go back and hopefully everything will be okay because I, I'm really ready to start moving these teeth again. Um, yes. All right, uh, sorry if you can hear the AC, I am sweating in here. Uh, I wanted to just show you how much better these aligners fit. So I just came out from the appointment. I had to replace the button on the canine um, and it made me slightly worried about the fact that I have to remove 
all of them because it wasn't painful but that was not pleasant and I'm just dreading the day they have to take off all of them because that's gonna be a very intense appointment anyways replace the button he did some filing and essentially I think I have a new treatment so the plan is 22 weeks left so the treatment is slightly extended uh, in addition to having gone seven weeks without switching an aligner but that's fine I'm so excited just seeing the number in like the 20s I got really excited so uh, I'll show you it's so satisfying seeing it be like almost flush with my teeth oh, I'm really happy now I'm feeling so much better and these are so clear oh no more yellow stains I'm having such a high right now I'm really really happy just wanted to do that update um i guess i'll do another update in a couple of months and we'll see where my teeth are at i'm so excited i kind of feel like i just started invisalign all over again this is so weird i'm just feeling really really excited so um yay happy to keep going now all right see you in the next update bye